Hello everyone, in this video I will show you where I hunted to unlock brimstone bugs, lancer beetles, and wailing widows for a total of 75 charm points. The video was filmed during increased respawn rate in Zao, but can be done during regular respawn rate as well. At the rate in the video, it would take me about 2 hours to complete brimstone bugs, 3.5 to 4 hours for lancer beetles, and approximately 5.5 hours for wailing widows. We're going to start this video at the teleport and muggy plains that you can jump to right from the carpet. You'll enter each teleport to reach the rebel camp. You then leave the camp and follow the path to the mountain and head to the southeast, trying to get trapped in the way like I do. To access the cave, you must have completed Mission 1 of the Wrath of the Emperor quest, linked in the description below. There are a few willing widows you can kill before you enter the cave as well. As usual, I use diamond airs while doing my best jerry tasks, but if you're looking to use area runes, your best bet is GFB, followed by Avalanche. Once you go down both floors, we will reach the area where we will be hunting. The path I chose was to first go to the left, then follow the path all the way to the right, then the bottom path back to the left, and finish where the stairs are located for the mission to kill the keeper. There's nothing to kill down these stairs, so we can avoid it. Once I reach the stairs, I work my way back up to the north, ended the loop by the entrance, and then repeated my original path. Something to note is in my loot tracker, Brimstone Fangs and Brimstone Shells were both set as NPC price. These are both used for imbuements, so they may be worth a decent amount of gold on your server. Be sure to switch the price over to market value if you want a more accurate value in your analyzer. While I did a hunt here for an hour, I made around 80,000 gold worth of these products. Most likely, Wailing Widows will be the last thing on your list to get completed. If you want to focus on Wailing Widows only, you may want to try the Spotter Cave in Kralos. You can see the location of the cave on the pictured map or follow the link in the description. I hope this video can help you complete these entries. If you have any requests for future best entries you'd like to see completed, let me know. Happy hunting.